Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Zintle, also known as Sipahle. And today I want to share with you all the different phases that I went through with this Makoti attire, okay? So I thought this was going to be a fun idea because I really enjoyed each and every stage of the journey. And you know, I got to play around with some styles that I'm not used to. So if Makoti Goti content is something that you're interested in then keep watching the video so this is basically what the first outfit was so let me come closer so as you can see oh, i'm sweating um i've got the matte um i've got the matte duke on this is called ikechemia i actually think i did it wrong but but yeah just pretend it's on properly and then i had to wear like a blanket so this is called itagato if you actually want like a more in-depth video on what each of these items are and what they mean then let me know down in the comment section below so yeah so this is the blanket that i had to wear as you saw in my initial video i was wearing the blue one okay but i really like this one i think it's so girly and so stylish so yeah and i never really got to wear this one because you know i was only in the blanket for a week and a lot of that week was spent just me at home so i really didn't get to use this one and i really love this one and then yeah so i also had to wear a towel underneath like across my shoulder like that and then i also had to wear you know a scarf tied to the side like that and then underneath as you know it's just the normal apron and the skirt So yeah, that is my initial outfit. This is what I looked like in my first few days of being a Makoti. And yeah, I really, I really think this is like my favorite outfit, um, just out of them all, because it's that one outfit that I don't think I'm ever gonna wear ever again. Um, so I really love going back, you know, to when I was still new and I was still fresh and still learning everything I'm still learning but this is you know one of my favorite outfits I think it's because of the blanket but yeah let's move on to my second phase of the outfit so yeah I also got to wear this one for a very long time I think for most of december this is what i was looking like so as you saw i basically took off the blanket about a week later this is what i looked like i took off the blanket and the scarf that was girded around my waist and i'm left with either some kind of a blazer you can also wear a jersey i think any kind of you know like cover up is okay um but i like to alternate between a jersey and just a light blazer because it is hot okay it is extremely hot in east london lately so i go with this little light blazer or sometimes i switch it out and wear a cardigan jersey perfectly fine it's also black um i think i like to just stick to you know the neutral colors and have like a pop of color like in the form of the shirt or the patterns on my scarf um so yeah and then um i had to wear a towel um around my bust area and i secured it like around my bust and also down here so that you know everything can be covered so that is how the outfit evolved from the first week that you saw me up until now so yeah let's move on to my final form okay you guys so this is my final form so basically it's just the blazer remaining and the button down shirt and also um i get to wear the scarf still 
and the same skirt and the same you know apron as before either in blue or in brown so i kind of just switch them out and then when it comes to the duk i'm still wearing the shiny one so i wear the shiny one on a daily basis and that is pretty much what i look like now um i think i have about one more month left of you know this attire um i'm actually dreading changing out of these clothes because i've gotten so used to them and i've gotten so used to you know how nice everyone has been to me everyone loves oh my god you know everyone just smiles at me strangers literally just smile at me on the road in the malls just like everywhere and i really kind of enjoy the attention so i'm kind of dreading you know going back to civilian clothing but i'm also kind of excited to get out of you know having to soldier through the excessive heat <laughs> so i'm looking forward to flowy dresses i'm looking forward to just learning more about what my style is going to be from now on so yes guys if you missed the video we are actually put on this attire then go ahead and click this video right here because it contains everything that happened on that day so if you're interested in that make sure you check out that video next and i'll see you next week for another video thank you so much for watching guys bye